we're going to take a look at the parts of a fruit. Keep in mind that we have many different types of fruit, and so not all of them necessarily look the same. However, most of the fruits have the same parts. This is an apple. An apple is a smooth, rounded fruit with a red, yellow, or green skin and a crisp, whitish flesh that comes from a tree of the rose family. The apple has a pericarp, and the pericarp is the ripened walls of the ovary or the fruit, and it has three parts that protect the seed. In the, within the pericarp, there are three parts that we're gonna be learning about. The first one is the exoscarp. Exo means outside. And the exocarp is the protective layer that covers the outside of a fruit or vegetable. We know it also as a peel. Exocarp. The edible part of the pulpy fruit or vegetable, that means if we have a fruit that has flesh that we can eat, that part that we eat is called the mesocarp. We also know it as the flesh of the fruit. Inside the fruit, surrounding the seeds, we have the endocarp. Endo means in, and endocarp is also known as the core. And it's the tough central part of many fleshy fruits. Usually when we're eating an apple, this is the part that we leave. Now, inside the fruit is the seed. And the seed is the grain of a plant that is, has the power inside it to make a new plant. Now here at the very bottom of the apple, we have the blossom end. When we look at a flower, this is the calyx. Remember that within the calyx, we have the ovary. And once the, the ovary has been fertilized and then the, it, the fruit ripens, it grows. And what we have left is that blossom end. And so that's the calyx. And of course, so just as a flower has a stem, well, that stem is also in the fruit. And it's the stalk that supports the fruit. It, it, a stem is also in a flower or in a leaf, and it attaches it to the larger branch. And if the root grows down, the stem grows in the opposite direction. And of course, part of the flower, um, flowers are usually right next to some leaves. And so this is a leaf. And we had seen these before. This is a closer shot of those apple seeds. I hope you enjoyed this closer look at the different parts of the apple. You may have learned a few names like the pericarp, which is all of the parts that are surrounding the seeds, the exocarp, the mesocarp, and the endocarp, which is the peel, the flesh, and the core of the fruit. And then of course we notice that we still have the stem and the blossom end of the flower. And we have, all of this is protecting those tiny seeds that can become a new plant.